Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, so it's the weekend here. It's Saturday the 6th, and um, tonight I'm going to be hopping on to Shinkansen and heading over to uh, Tokyo to meet up with my boys, and um, we're going to drive straight to Chiba, and we're going to go to uh, my buddy Yoshiki's beach house in Chiba, and uh, we're going to sleep there tonight, and then about 5 o'clock in the morning, 5, 5.30, we're going to hit the surf. Um, I was just looking at the charts right now, and uh, tomorrow's forecast for the Chiba region, uh, they're saying 8 to 10 foot, 3 foot overhead to double overhead. A um, little bit of a wind, about 7, 12 knots in the morning. Uh, not particularly the greatest winds, but um, northeast winds, so... Uh, with Chiba, that's kind of side shore, side shore, onshore. Um, now, eight to ten foot. I've never surfed Chiba eight to ten foot. I've surfed in uh, Chiba my first time last year in November, and uh, it was about waist to head high. Pretty fun, a little walled up, but pretty fun. Uh, recently, I surfed in Chiba on July twentieth, which is a holiday here in Japan. Uh, it's Umi no Hi, uh, which is Sea Day. Uh, so uh, we surfed in Chiba and that was pretty small, pretty small, uh, not a whole lot of fun. I got a little video of that I'll add in here. Uh, but looks like this time we have an approaching typhoon. So it's not going to hit Japan, but uh, we got waves pushing in. Uh, today was uh, four to five foot shoulder to head high uh, over there in Chiba. And, but tomorrow morning it's going to be hitting. So. It's going to be pretty interesting to see uh, what Chiba breaks like on a really big size surf. Um, there's a lot of spots, jetties and bends and uh, areas in Chiba uh, along the Chiba coast here in South Chiba, uh, Middle Chiba. Um, that look pretty decent, maybe a hold a swell, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, it all depends on the push, um, the tides, the tide's going to be... Uh, high tide at 6.46 a.m. And uh, you can literally be in the water here at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Uh, the sun comes up at 4.30. Well, not... It's light at 4.30. But you can be in the water at 5 a.m. Um, temperature looks about... Uh, in Fahrenheit, about 79, 80. Uh, so, pretty warm. No wetsuit. Uh, should, be, uh, should be a good day, I hope. I hope. I uh, really want to surf some fun waves with my crew. Um, so yeah, I'm be heading out on my Shinkansen. Uh, in Shinkansen tonight, I got my ticket. Uh, it's about an hour and a half, hour and 40 minutes uh, to uh, Ueno Station in Tokyo. My boys will pick me up from there. And then we're going to shoot right over, right over to Chiba. Uh, from, from Ueno, maybe about an hour, hour and a half, I think at the most, uh, to my friend's house. And then, uh, like I said, we'll we'll wake up early and we'll get on it. So I'm gonna try to take a bunch of video and pictures um, once I get there uh, in the morning, and uh, show you guys, you know, a little Chiba surf here in Japan. Um, I'm pretty excited. You know, I, I don't have a I don't have a problem surfing eight to ten foot as long as it's uh, not walled up and just closed out everywhere. You know, that's the big thing. You know, back in Florida, uh, we get hurricane surf. It's just walled up and just dumps everywhere nothing holds so I'm, I'm excited to see what Chiba has an offer here and um, yeah 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 so I'm gonna show you guys the models right now I'll show you what I'm looking at so you can kinda get an idea what it looks like so here is the Chiba uh, regional forecast as you can see here uh, here's today Saturday uh, four to five foot shouldered head high it's been like that for the past couple weeks actually or a week and a half or so looking pretty fun I've been seeing some pictures from over there it looks really fun I uh, wish I could surf every day but no, I can't do that so for tomorrow morning this is the forecast 7 to 9 a.m. 8 to 10 foot 3 foot overhead and double overhead uh, we're gonna be right in here on this bend this is the Chiba bend we're gonna be either surfing right in the middle or along Ichinomi here uh, that faces kinda south southeast a little bit so maybe uh, that area is probably going to be the best but maybe a little bit smaller on the inside here so we'll drive around and check it out 
and uh, see what areas look the best. I'm pretty excited. I want to see uh, what some waves will do here on this coast. So hopefully it's fun.
Yeah, it's a beautiful morning. We've got good waves. Wow, check this out. Woo wee! Oh yeah, we got waves. This is Heibara. Few boys out. Definitely a long way down. Wow, pumped. We're gonna find some waves here and surf. Check this beautiful day out here. And we got typhoon waves. Oh yeah. Look at that nug. Lots and lots of nugs. Look at this one sucking up. Oh man. Whoa ho ho ho. Find a spot here and get served. All right, we're here at Onjuku. Came around the corner, it's a little smaller, but looks a little more playful here. So we're gonna paddle out and have fun. Hopefully the water's not too cold. Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, Chiba update. Uh, a couple days ago, I surfed uh, in Chiba with my crew uh, for the typhoon swell. Uh, we had a great time. Um, we woke up early uh, from my buddy's beach house and checked it. There was definitely plenty of swell. Uh, it wasn't as crazy as I thought it was going to be. Uh, I thought it was going to be really walled up and huge and macking. Because um, that's usually how Florida is when we get any kind of hurricane swell in Florida. But um, the typhoon was really close uh, offshore. Um, and I thought it was going to be a lot bigger, but it wasn't. Uh, most spots, uh, it hadn't really hit early in the morning. Uh, we did check this one spot that I liked, a, I really liked a lot. It was a point break. Uh, and it was a rocky point break. And it was called Heibara. And there was a bunch of people out in front of us on the inside uh, it was okay of a wave, but up the point, uh, there was a few people out, and this left was absolutely firing. I wanted to surf so bad, I was frothing, uh, but I couldn't get my buddies to go. They uh, were like, no, thank you, too crazy for us, too crazy. I'm like, really? Oh my gosh, like this wave was firing. And uh, they just kept saying, uh, Abunai, uh, which means danger. So uh, to them, they don't have no part of it, so... We end up going around the corner down into this bay called Onjuku. Uh, it's a beach break. Uh, it was packed. There was a lot of people, but plenty of waves to go around. We surfed there for four hours. Still had a good time. It was like six foot, uh, four to six foot. Uh, it was fun, laughs and rights. Uh, I got all the waves I wanted. Um, water was actually a little cool. I was surprised about the water. Uh, I had a long sleeve wetsuit top on. And um, I was a little cold in the beginning. Uh, then I started catching waves and I warmed up and I caught more waves and got a little more warmer. But then I got cold again 
and then I got warm again. It was kind of off and on, but it was all good. Uh, I hate wetsuits, so uh, it is what it is. But we had a good time in Chiba with the crew. Um, so, yeah, yeah, had a good time. Looking forward to some more ways in Chiba.